My name's Ganga Giri. I've been playing didgeridoo for around 30 years and the instrument and connection to Aboriginal culture and to country have been amazing gifts for me personally and I just want to get amongst it and help facilitate that experience for the greater community. It's an opportunity to sit with Aboriginal people to learn. I, I feel that when we look, listen and learn on country, uh, we can absorb and learn so much um, amazing knowledge that we don't normally have access to in everyday life. Did we do? It's, it's, it welcomes everybody. Because Mother Earth, we all live here. All of us, all around. No matter where we're from, we're all on this one big Mother Earth. Did we do? And play a big part of connecting us together. Where, where non-Indigenous and, 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 and Indigenous are still both learning. The did you do? What the meaning of life? And did you name life? Because mother and give earth and breathe oxygen from tree. So when, when we're playing, it same like a, uh, what do they call them, that thing? Heartbeat. I'm like medicine too, like doctor. But I'm a wood tree for mother. But bring it like to, for people that understand, that's what I'm doing. And they've been doing it to us for many years, spiritually, mentally, and physically. Uh, making a didgeridoo or yidaki and playing it is just really the catalyst. But it's an amazing gift and it's an amazing uh, journey to be able to go out and look for a termite hollowed log in nature, bring it back in and start carving it. And then it's really amazing when you can actually get to play it after some of that hard work and really hear that beautiful tone of the didgeridoo. And that there is an amazing way to connect with country. My name is Henning Geld and I'm really, really passionate about the top end of Australia. It's an amazing part of this land to visit and um, have a look at. And uh, what makes it really amazing is that it's home to traditional Aboriginal culture that everybody can experience. I've been uh, spending a bit of time up there as a tour guide as well. I've been tour guiding in West Arnhem Land in Kakadu. I'm a biologist by trade. I started learning playing didgeridoo in 1990 and I was adopted by younger people in Northeast Arnhem Land. I have to say one of the most amazing things you can do in this country is to spend time with Aboriginal people and to learn from them. To be frank, some of my most amazing lifetime experiences have been with Aboriginal people and that's what I would love to share with all of you. Why don't you come on a tour? Forget about the books, forget about the documentaries for a while. Sitting down with people on country and having this really deep experience, feeling the country, feeling the culture, and making connections, I bet you want to come back.